In this study about uh, television viewing and the economics of channel surfing, we show that uh, basically people are inertial. It means that they stick with whatever channel they are viewing, even if there are appealing options on other channels. And this is because basically they procrastinate their decision and to look for other options that are already available there. There are many reasons for that and usually there are many studies that show the rationality of uh, consumers' behavior, for example. And uh, usually the people that are defending the rationality of consumers are saying that there are three basic reasons for that. And one is that, that there are too many options, or that the consumers don't have enough information about the possible options, and also because there are switching costs to, for choosing other options. Well, in this study, it was really particularly suited because we were able to rule out all these possibilities. And in channel viewing, there was a lot of information about what was being broadcasted and the options were not so many. In switching channel, really, it is easy because you just have to push a button. So why people are irrational and what are the implications of that? are irrational because really they are inertial and they try to remain on that option unless there is something really negative about that channel. There are many reasons for that. For example, the Nobel Prize Daniel Kahneman said that there are different kind of systems in our brains that are activated at different times. One is thinking very fast and one is thinking very slow. And usually when you don't have to pay a lot of attention, you are not behaving in a rational way. So that could be the reason why television viewers are sticking with their channels because they don't pay too much, much attention and want to really put the effort on finding other solutions. Also, we have seen that according to different kind of theories, people are not maximizing their choices, but they are satisfying their choices. It means that they stick with their choices until something is really wrong with that. And we can see many examples in real life, for example, in, in marriages or in sentimental relationship, that you're not always looking for the Prince Charming and you just settle with the options that you have. So, uh, there are many implications both for consumers and for managers. Let's start with the consumers. The consumers, uh, if they are stuck with their previous options, that is a good thing for many companies because they can count on uh, uh, faithful consumers. It could be uh, dangerous for new companies that will try to enter the market because it would be difficult to steal the consumers from other companies. There are also implications for managers because if they are inertial as well, then if they are stuck with their decisions and everyone else is not moving, that is fine. But if you are stuck and all the other people around are changing their decisions and are reacting in different ways, that could be dangerous because you can be left behind perhaps forever.